Drones can't seem to keep out of trouble. Well, at least for a few problematic pilots anyways. Like late last year, when Gatwick Airport in Britain was shut down for nearly two days after unidentified drones were seen flying over the airfield. And in October 2017, when an army helicopter hit a drone in midair. Some sophisticated solutions have come online, like Battelle's Drone Defender, which takes drones down with a point-and-shoot system that attacks the radio control frequency. Other tactics rely on deploying a net from another drone to ensnare the unidentified flying object. Well now, researchers from the US Army have patented a new 40 millimeter grenade that can take down drones after being fired from anything from smaller handheld M320 grenade launchers to the larger MK19. As you can see from the illustration, the grenades take down the drones with a net. The net is under a proximity sensor that detonates a small charge which blows the warhead apart and throws the net about six to nine meters from the target. The new invention was patented last week and came with a little bit of fanfare because it brings a little innovation to grenade launchers. I mean, the MK-19s have been around since the 60s. The photos you're looking at are the standard version of the munition used in the M203 and M320 launchers and the round with a net won't look too much different. The new warhead was invented by the Armament Research Development and Engineering Center at the Picatinny Arsenal in New Jersey. In initial tests, it has at least proven more effective than other countermeasures, like that bang and net deploying drone I mentioned earlier. And while it might be a little less exciting, it's also more cost effective than shooting down drones with a shoulder fired missile. One of the biggest benefits of the 40 mm grenade launcher platform is that it has been used by foreign and domestic forces for several decades so there won't be a steep learning curve or additional equipment. Brian Metzger, senior technology manager at TechLink, told IEN that the Army's net grenade isn't completely destructive, which is important if you want to examine the target drone forensically after you've brought it down. TechLink manages technology transfer for the Department of Defense. Metzger told IEN that now that the Army's patented it, we're preparing to navigate U.S. businesses through licensing, which gives them the rights to manufacture it for domestic, non-military, and qualified foreign customers. I mean, those pesky drone pilots, just a couple of guys ruining it for everybody. I mean, the only thing worse are, like, those heathens with the high-powered laser pointers. I'm David Manti. This is IEN Now.